welcome to a week in my life as an NYU student. Um, this is me trying <laughs> to get my shit together. Um, trying being the operative word. So this is today's fit. It's the, the going to Trader Joe's fit. Otherwise I would be in my pajamas right now. Um, it's noon on a Sunday. <laughs> So we got the ghost t-shirt, which I realized after the fact that it's Easter and my goal is not to offend anybody. Um, necklace, this is faux vintage. It's a little locket, it's a big locket. Um, paper clip, which I always wear. Earrings, we got the teeth, which I made in like sophomore year of high school maybe. And then the baths, which were a gift from my friend and she got them from a goth store in Fullerton. I wanted to say Fresno and that is absolutely not right. Um, and then for makeup, it's kind of giving Amy Lee, it's kind of giving that one Godsmack album cover. It's just like black on the lid, red in the crease and yeah. This is the fit. I'm going to Trader Joe's to get groceries. Um, and then, yeah, we'll see what I do with the rest of the day. I really don't feel like doing work today. I did so much work all weekend, and now I'm like, that's it, I'm done. I don't have it in me to do any more work, but we'll see what happens. Yeah. I just finished eating lunch, and honestly, like I have so much work that I need to do today but i spent all day friday and all day saturday working and i'm kind of like burnt out and i like need to give myself a mental break so i think what i'm gonna do right now is just like um go back through like old sketchbook pages and find like room where there's like gaps and i can like just squeeze in like smaller drawings and do that because there's a lot of space like that in my sketchbook um i've like flagged some of the pages or I need to do that. Good morning. I would say happy Monday, but Mondays are not a happy occurrence in my books. Um, I'm awake against my will. It's actually like 10.45, oh my god. So yeah, it's Monday. I desperately need to do my laundry, so I'm gonna do that right now. We're rocking with the, the My Chem shirt and the sweats. Um, <laughs> all right, laundry has been done, folded, put away, and <laughs> what else? The offending lipstick is still offending. It's really pink. I don't know, y'all. Um, all right, um, I have to leave for a class right now, but quick fit check. Um, MCR shirt, this is the same jacket from yesterday. Um, this is what my friends call the dill flocket because it has Anakin and Obi-Wan in it. Um, skirt. I'm wearing tights underneath because I don't know if it's cold. And then the big, the big docks. These little elephant earrings. And then in my doubles, I just have studs. Um, so yeah, that's the fit. Okay. Hi, I just got back from my Monday class, which is still moving images. So... We were working on crits from our last project, um, and that ended up taking all class. So pretty low key, like laid back because I presented mine last time. So this time I just got to sit and watch other people's projects. So yeah, that was pretty chill. Um, and then ate some dinner. And then yeah, I picked up some packages from the mailroom. So this is paint. This is gouache because I have acrylic paint here, and I'm working on a painting for my brother as a graduation gift. Because I'm going to his graduation in two weeks. And I was going to do it in acrylic, but I honestly just, like, don't really enjoy working in acrylic that much. Y'all, this dining hall food is, like, literally making my stomach hurt. It consistently does this, too. And not just to me. Did y'all see that? Okay, anyways, um, this is the Tuesday fit. We just got the wide leg Levi's. These are so comfortable, y'all. Um, the tunnel vision tank top. The arm warmers, just cause like the morning is a bit colder, but it's supposed to be really hot this afternoon. Um, little breath. 
little heart necklace, which is just really cute. And then this choker is from my friend Lars. He makes jewelry, like goth punk jewelry. Um, he's super cool. Like one of the coolest people I know. He's like my punk older brother. Um, he is Lars Gothica here on YouTube. And then on Depop and Instagram, his shop is Blood Moon Bazaar. So I will link that um in the description and if i forget to somebody please leave me a comment because i really want to like link his stuff he's so cool the plan is um my bed's not made <laughs> and my pillowcase is so stained with hair dye i don't know if y'all can see that that's insane so i had my first class of the day and it was my writing class and that's on zoom um so that's really great because i normally like get ready and do my makeup if we have like more like downtime during that class or the professor's just lecturing or whatever um and then right now I have my programming class, which I actually like need to run out the door for that. Um, and then this afternoon I have my audio engineering class. So yeah, hopefully I will um, film more today because yesterday I didn't end up filming um, anything in the evening. So I had my class after class like in the nighttime i ended up going to target with skylar and josh which was really really fun so yeah that was yesterday got a little jacket on for the morning walk um yeah like hover over it first yeah Matt and I went to the audio lab to work on our music projects and then um, the guitar amp wasn't there so I basically didn't record anything because I didn't want to work with synths and I really don't want to work with MIDI but it looks like I'm gonna have to so um yeah. <laughs> I am so tired. It's literally noon. I've barely done any work. I stopped filming at some point yesterday. I didn't film my audio class and I didn't film anything after, but I didn't really do anything after. So that's fine. I'm so fried. I am on my second cup of coffee, like just back to back chugging coffee. Um, and I spilled some on my bed. So I actually probably have to go put my sheets and my blanket in the wash right now and then just work. Um, while that's in the wash. I needed to do that anyways, to be honest. This is just like the the catalyst to actually get me to do that. All right, I've retrieved my laundry. I am a little bit more alive now. I think the two back-to-back -back cups of coffee are starting to kick in. So I'm gonna make my bed um, and hopefully not spill coffee on it again in the near future. Um, yeah, I, I was gonna do work while waiting for my laundry and then my mom called and we were talking about my brother's graduation and we just ended up talking for like two hours or not two hours however long it takes to do laundry the washer is like half an hour the dryer is like 45 minutes um that is definitely not two hours that's like an hour and 15 minutes you know what i love is paying two dollars to use the dryer every time and then um it doesn't dry my shit Oh my gosh, okay, so for my girlies, um, or wh whomever, who may like true crime podcasts, um, my favorite murder is so entertaining. it's just, um, like, it really just feels like chatting with your bestie about <laughs> true crime, it's so fun, the hosts, Karen and Georgia, are great. Visually blind. Visually blind. And then, um, you're gonna choose a scene from each film, which is a good example. Good morning, happy Thursday. I'm gonna speed run the quickest fit check known to man because I literally slept through my 8 a.m. class today and I need to run to campus for my 10 a.m. Um, $5 Target tank top. This little vest was from some sketch <laughs> that looked like a drop shipper, but then I looked it up on Good On You and it got like good environmental ratings and like 
employee treatment ratings, whatever. Um, these shorts were my mom's in the early 2000s. The brand is Element. Ouija board necklace I made in freshman year of high school, and I also have matching Ouija board earrings. I forgot to put it, but I'm gonna put it in now. This little necklace is um, somebody at the hair salon my mom used to go to made jewelry, so she made this. Um, I ended up straightening my hair today just because like my hair was kind of like not wanting to really be wavy but then like it was yeah I literally don't understand how every day in high school I would go to sleep past midnight and then wake up at like 5 45 a.m I went to like not my local high school I went to an arts high school so like it was far away I just had to wake up as early and then it would go like super late into the evening so then I'd stay up super late and I just like nowadays I'm like if I don't get my eight hours I am not gonna be a functional human being um I also think it's really really funny when I'm sleep deprived the vocal fry comes out and it's like oh yeah this this chick's from California um so anyways I gotta skedaddle to class but I will see you guys later all right hey y'all today today has been a long and tiring day so first of all I slept through my 8 a.m class which is just not good um but whatever and then I went to my 10 a.m class and literally I was one of seven people who showed up for that class like I got there it was me and two other kids in the room um and then like by the time it was like 15 minutes into the class there was five of us and by the end of the class there was only seven of us and the professor was just like what do I do um and like she acknowledged she's like yeah okay the weather is really nice today if I was trapped in a dorm I can't say it wouldn't do the same, but like, yeah. Um, and then I had my audio engineering class, which I ended up attending over Zoom just cause like, I was so tired. I was like, there's no way I'm leaving my dorm again um, after I'd come back from my programming class. So yeah, I had that class. I turned in my project um, that was due today and now I'm like dying tired so i did the one thing i said i was not gonna do today and i worked on the painting that i said i was way too tired to work on and of course if you're way too tired to work on a painting it doesn't turn out well so yeah i like it's supposed to be a graduation picture of my brother it's like a painting of him now and a painting of him as a baby i was working on the baby face and i made his eyes way too because glass is a water activated medium, if you really want to start over, slap a wet paper towel on that thing, let it sit for a few minutes and mop that shit up. Like it, it'll come off. Um, but I'm like, do I really want to restart? Like the eyes look ridiculous. They look humongous, but like, oh my God, that was so much work. Okay, quick Friday update. I mean, I kind of fell off with this whole weekly vlog thing, but I'll scrape it together. Um, so it's like, 2.45. Spent the entire day up until this point working on programming and I got everything up to date finally. I have been working on this like just like updating my website and just like reorganizing everything. I have been just non-stop programming for what feels like I think like two and a half weeks now like um so I finally have everything up to date and like how I want it and then fixed all my old code and whatever. Um, so I'm done with that and I'm like, you know what? It's a nice day out, it's sunny, it's warm. Um, and I've been sitting in my little dorm room cube all day. Let me just go outside and go to the park and take my sketchbook or whatever. I'm not even gonna lie, I fell off with the vlogging towards the end of the week. Um, so I think I'm gonna end this here. I'm sorry, I'm like, I find this hilarious. My hair on this side is curling away from my face and my hair on this side is curling towards my face. It just looks like I got hit with like a really strong gust of wind. Um, but yeah, I kind of fell off with the vlogging towards the end of the week. It was just classes and work and me being incredibly tired. So now it seems like a good place to end this. Um, so yeah, I hope i managed to edit this in a way that's enjoyable for y'all um and i'm gonna go brush my hair so 